the seeker deer have started creeping into the lush cultivated fields. It's a whole new world. These fields are brimming with specially sown grass, intended for cattle. But this herd always seems to be one step ahead, helping themselves to the best grass before it can even be cut. Every year, deer can munch their way through over 30 million pounds worth of crops. But some farmers have developed a live and let live attitude. The deer are reaping the benefits of Hokkaido's human landscape. In a place like this, it pays to be adaptable. In the warmth of early summer, the red-crowned cranes have moved into the farmland waterways. And they have a new family member. They traditionally nest in marshes, but most have been drained. So the cranes are raising their chick in an irrigation channel. All through the summer, the chick will be entirely dependent on its parents for food. The channel is teeming with insects, fish and frogs, but the parents can barely keep up with their gangly offspring's appetite. The family won't be able to move on until the chick can fly. In the meantime, they can't escape from surprise visitors. The seeker deer have managed to wander right into the path of a pair of cranes with a weak old chick. Mum and Dad work together to shepherd the chick to safety. And then a quick flash of the dagger-like beak to make sure the deer keep their distance. parent's diligence has paid off. Their priority now is to feed their chick while times are good. <laughs> 